and one. Hey, internet, welcome back to the Cat on Arcade. We're back without a while, let's go! The first part did well on the channel, and like, by a significant margin. It got 14 views, but sometimes when a video hits number one of the lot, like YouTube will rate, it will compare your most recent video to like the last 10 you've uploaded. Uh, so on my type on my main cha my lifestyle channel, if I upload a typing video, it'll be like 350 views, like number one out of ten, good job. And on this one, it, videos will hit like four views, and it will be like number one, good job. But this one, the first part hit like 14 views or something. Uh, so cheers if you're you know if you've watched all five before this, thank you. Uh, that's super cool. I've just uploaded all of them. I edited them all yesterday, and then just batch uploaded. Um, so, I don't know, that it's just super cool. Let's see, yeah, it's got 15 views now, and the average is three to five. And the average watch time is 1.8 hours. Sorry, no, seven minutes and 13 seconds. <laughs> Which, for a 50 minute video is not great, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, but the total watch time is whatever. Um, yeah, that's all I really wanted to say, I don't know. It's just cool to see that. Um, playing this on a weekday, what a shocker. Uh, my friend sent me, Okay, now the probe goes that way. A video on the documentary, and I just, I wanna know how they like make this because, um, nope, these are all the same. There was some part of it that was like, when you jump, technically, okay, the keyboard is being weird again. When you jump, actually, it's not you moving, it's the whole world moving. Or like everything else is moving. You don't move. Everything else moves down. While you move up. Which I thought was bananas. But the thing has spoilers in it. So I'm not watching it yet. Which, I don't know. It's it's just very, I want to see making up. But anyway. We have options. So. I was thinking about this right before, right? And it occurred to me that. All the question marks. And I noticed this yesterday. When I did the last part, right? All these question marks are something I've read about, but haven't actually been in. So, I mean, this is on Brittle Hollow. Um, anglerfish fossil, I would need to like get in there somehow. Escape pod one to shelter site, not really sure how those are linked or whatever. White hole station, oh, there's more to explore here. Maybe I'll do this first. Because I, I thought I got everything there. Um, and then, yeah, high energy lab, like, haven't found that. Sun station. How do I get there? I don't know. The sunless city, still more to whatever. Um, northern glacier. Frick, what? Alright, you know what? Let's do that first, then. Actually, let's just view the entry itself real quick. Okay. Let's, yes. Okay, we're gonna go there first. Fantastic. And I think this is going to be the approach. Also, the face cam is so much easier this way. So much easier. Just for so many reasons. Um, oh, that's the wrong one. <laughs> Yoink. Okay. Um, -da 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 autopilot, like, right off the bat, pretty much. Or not. Ugh, this again, dude. I don't know why my controller, like, sometimes doesn't work. This is so annoying. Um, but yeah, the keyboard got stuck in the in the episode where I just went just hundreds of thousands of kilometers. Mm, that's the lantern, that's the lantern, that's the lantern. Abort, abort, abort. Whoo! That was very close. Go ahead and match the velocity of this bad boy. Love it. But yeah, this is legitimately so cool. Okay. Oh, I also wanted to try flying, uh, shooting this out of the gravity cannon. The achievements gave me a little, uh, little cheat, cheat, not a cheat, but, um, little hint as to what, just things I could try. Whoopsie. All right, cool. That should do. Ah, there we go. Already in the suit, we're good. Okay, so uh, wrong way. Good job. Mike. This is Brittle Hollow, right? 
At least I think. Okay, so the northern glacier is here. And there's more to explore. Please bars spare jetpack fuel. Fells bars, whoops. So when you're slow, I can't use it, I'm leaving this here. Check my level scout. I do too use it. Horn fells, your burnt marshmallow. If the fuel's still around, feel free to use it. If not, I'm sure you got bigger problems. Okay. It's a little strange to just have it there, but... Did I not see this? Any of this? No, I definitely saw this part. The Hanging hang City. Oh, I haven't actually been to the Hanging City. Have I? Because it is still a question mark on the whatever. Um, okay, but there is something I've missed in general. Is this... Hmm. No. Maybe the fuel's there if you come from White Hall, White Hall Station. Yeah, I remember reading this part. Um. Just the the whole. Oh my God! Projection stone. Oh my God! Projection stone. And it's brittle hollow too. Wait, what? I am dumb. I brought it all the way back to Giant's Deep last time? Dude. Why? <laughs> huh. The weird frame rate thing is happening again. Um. <laughs> How did I not? What? <laughs> I wonder if I can teleport from here. Whitehall. I mean, I mean, if this is Brittle Hollow, in theory, I can just yeet into the black hole, grab the projection plate, right? The projection plate, I think, was at Whitehall. Maybe, like, will I get something different if I look at the projection plate here? I'm very uncertain. Let me just follow this. I don't know. I mean, once I warp back, I should be fine. Oh my god, what, wait, have I been here before? I think I have. Maybe? Yes. Pretty sure. The trees are moving. Yes. Um, and I came from below. I remember that. Am I right about this warp thing? Right? Okay, let's yeet into here, I guess. Or should I have gone in there? I don't really know. Oh, that's a fascinating thought. Hmm. Okay, I never mind. I see how the supernovas now. Wow, my brain is. Yikes. Um. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, no, this is not where I work from. Yes, it is. Is it? I don't... What is... What? I don't know, dude. Bet. Yeah, this is where I work from. Okay. So if I grab the projection plate... Ember Twin. Yes, that sounds about right. This will project me to Brittle Hollow as soon as they light, line up. But there's more to explore here. Oh, I need to turn it, don't I? <laughs> that would help. Let's just put this down for a sec. There's more to explore here. I'm gonna go back and the brittle hall is gonna be totally falling apart. Maybe there isn't? I And then it rotates that way. But then if I do this... It goes the other way. Okay. I don't... I don't know what... Is there a way to stop it? Actually, hold on. If I remove the stone... Don't teleport yet. Yes, yeah, so if I remove this... I don't think the rotation of this stops, does it? 
No, because it's in space. It's always going to stay the same. Unless there's something slowing it down. But it doesn't look like it. Okay, so clearly I don't teleport it just to about anything. I need to wait for it to rotate, I guess. Because I want to go back to Brittle Hollow. And this is obviously where it'll take me to the northern glacier thing. Seeing as that's where the warp point is. Or so I am hoping. Yeah. Alright, fantastic. Um, I forgot the goddamn plate, dude. <laughs> give me the, where's the freaking, give me this. I remember this being low-key instantaneous last time. Oh, it must have been because as you go back and forth, it's key spinning, obviously. Okay, never mind. So, okay, actually I do remember what this projection plate looked like simply because I, I think I used the screenshot for the thumbnail. Um, so we hop up over here. Um, okay, so if I put this in here, it didn't show text last time, like on the Giants Deep one. Okay, this I definitely haven't seen. Rami and I reviewed the record you sent, Poke, and they appear to show Nomai arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow slightly before departing from the White Hole. So, huh. I understand it's exceedingly odd, but Clary and I have tested and retested the equipment, and the result is the same every time someone warps. The interval is incredibly minuscule, roughly 100,000. Do you suppose our instruments can't actually measure time since it's degree? These measurements can't be accurate. How can I know my arrival in Brittle Hollow before he or she ever set them on the teleport? Implications are absurd. I don't disagree. It would mean I've inadvertently broke several fundamental theories regarding this universe. We'd have to reconsider all our beliefs around the nature of time. Yes, I hope so too. Pokey has Pi is, is confident in the readings is accurate. She's kindly helping me attempt to recreate this from a high energy lab. This is the high energy lab is the can is in the canyon on Ember Twins Equator. Come in come here at once, you need to see this. Um Okay. That's low key our next destination then. Uh let me take this. Put in here. Is it the same thing? Yes. No? I can't tell, honestly. What did I figure about these projection stunts again? I feel like I figured something out and then I just forgot about it. I don't know, if I walk away, it's gonna disappear, yeah. Um, okay. So I'm pretty sure that's that for High Glacier or whatever. Oh. Oh, that's fun. Um, okay, so we have some options. So, this fuel thing is very fascinating because it tells me that there is an instant such that I will show up at this location without my ship. Have I, have I read this? A phantom moon that sometimes greets us. Two shadows shows its face. Moon isn't volcanic, at least nights at a time. There can exist too much lava. We test the null hypothesis. Um, it's a funny statistics joke. Oh, okay, so I didn't read that. Okay, cool. Oh, was there something I missed over here then? If I haven't been here, then I can't imagine I've been around here. Okay. Well, um, I don't think I can get to the center of the Ember Twin at the moment, simply because it's probably full of sand. Let's go ahead and check the log. The log is updated, but no new entries explicitly. Um, the sun, I think I want to go back here because that's where the high energy lab, I mean, like I found the entrance to it, right? Maybe not. It's it's on Ember, okay, the Ember, Ember Twin is where the high energy lab is. Um, we, we got that though, so we're good with Northern Glacier. Um, yes, high energy lab. A path from the Sunless City, yes. 
Negative time interval was further at the guy. <sighs> I guess that's the logical step. No, my mind. Okay, I guess there's more there. Right, that's what I. Okay. Um. Yes. Okay. Okay. Um. We have, like I've said before, options. I want to go to the center of Ember's Core, but I want as much time as possible, so I'm very glad I learned this meditation thing. And let's go ahead and meditate. Ah. This is something about time loops like this, right? If... If I go... If I loop time again, I am technically traveling in time. But if I'm traveling in time, I mean, I'm not, I'm not gonna think about this. I'm just, the brain versus the mind. Because time travel implies that there is a soul. Um, <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like there's a very deep answer there that I can't quite just leave open. <laughs> but I'm gonna leave it open anyway. Um, that is so fascinating. I wonder if I can get up there and follow it. Because I can actually see it. We're following the probe, boys. This is the first time I've ever been able to actually see it. I mean, it's just gonna keep going, isn't it? Unless it... Yeah, it's literally never gonna stop. Okay, which means I've just wasted a loop. Um, all right. Uh, well, you know what? <laughs> it's worth a shot, I suppose. It just goes too fast. I mean, if I keep accelerating and the probe stays at its, you know, whatever speed, then I'll eventually hit it. But I don't think it's worth it right now. There's gotta be some... It's gotta launch in some direction where it hits a planet. Like, that's my best guess at the moment. Because um, if I look this way... Oh, frick. Why does this keep happening? Okay. I keep getting distracted by, like, all the things. Um, what the... F okay. Uh, can you zoom in on that falling thing? Just in case... I don't know. No one saw it. I don't know. Frick enough. Whatever. Um, oh, there's the probe again. Cool. Yeah, so my guess at the moment is that the probe has to be launched in some direction that it hits the planet. Um, but the odds of that happening, I feel like, are highly unlikely. So how on earth do I get in? Well, I guess how on earth is definitely the wrong phrasing, but... <laughs> Uh, can I use these stairs to get up? There are stairs here, aren't there? No, there aren't. Um. Alright, I'm just gonna trust what I did the first time. Maybe I'm misremembering what I did the first time. Where's Banjo Man? Making it in space does not help matters, I guess. Um, okay, what the hell? Oh, what does go say? What is this? What is this? Okay, no, 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 no. Oh, this is a broken door that I have seen before. Frick. Where is the... F oh my god. <laughs> this is so sad. This is, this is the weird thing about long-term content. I'm so tempted to hit a, hit a button so that when I go edit this, I can cut this out. This useless timeout. 
Um, it's he's not even on this half of the planet, I guess. What the frick? I remember crossing through the center here. Okay, you know what? I remember this broken bridge. That that much I do remember. So let's give this a shot. So if I remember crossing through here. Let's just go until the Sunless City gets closer. That makes sense, right? It must have been obvious the first time. Okay, and if I go this way, I am getting closer. But I don't think that way would be closer. I really should conserve my fuel, but I'm impatient. Okay, and now we go this way to get closer. Is this behind me? No. Okay. Okay, and when we go this way. Bro, I don't get it. What did I do to get here the first time? I need to go back and check. Unless it's through here, but I don't think so. I mean, yeah, I've had that before. Oh my god, it was through here. Am I dumb? Uh, actually, this looks new. No, it doesn't. This is exactly it. God damn it, Mark. Yeah, this is exactly it. God, frick, I forgot this whole bit. And while these rocks are interesting, they wait, wait until less urgent time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do not follow this tunnel to its end. Okay, that's a little sus. We found an enormous cavern at the end of this passage. This appears promising a living construct once term shelter. Yeah, this is it. This is the start of the path to the shelter site. So I've left directions to guide you there. Okay, yeah, this is it. Wow, good job, Mark. Okay, when, then what's this one? So these all are different. This passage leads to breathable air. Heat of this alien sun. Okay. So this is trees. I remember being here. Okay. Yes. Very, very epic. Okay. This is all... I'm glad I, you know, found it again, though. Because I would have just been like, really? <laughs> Dumbo? Okay. Now we descend. Future mark. Optional. I don't know how not valuable at all, but... You know, cut out probably 15 or 20 minutes. Um, I'm sure I've got this. If, I've, if I just saw it now as easily as I did, someone come. So follow the instructions. Yeah. Almost definitely. Okay. And then this is go straight and take a left and then so yeah, turn left and go up. Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> Love it. So you're at, you are definitely in a little bit of a race against time here. This is the first time I died. Ugh. It's so nostalgic. Take a left sand pit. I wonder what happens if you go through the tunnels, but that's for later. And now we can go up. Oh, wow. Okay, 50% fuel, that should be okay. He says, with no confidence. Lovely. Be cautious crossing the chasm ahead. Look for the tunnel hidden behind the falling sand, yes. That I do remember. I wonder. Is that just death? Well, the textures are a little unfortunate. Yeah, I don't think there's anything down here. Uh, actually, there was a bridge. Wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I 
practically don't have time for this, but... This drops so fast. Wait. Okay, there we go. That's... God, there's so much here, but anyway. Continuing on the known path here. Uh, yes. Hurry before the sand comes. Wait, whoa. Oh. <laughs> I guess the Nomai could fly, question mark? What are... Like, the controller vibrates, but do I die? I don't really want to find out. Uh, I, remember, I remember going up these stairs before. And, ah, yes, this is where the angler falls off. Where is the other entrance? That's the oh, it's right up here. Nope, that was a graphical glitch. Um. Oh. Hello. I didn't see that marking beforehand. The uh, you know, the language is right there. Ah, that's the entrance up there then. It fell down. Fascinating. Oh, there is a gravity thing there. Okay. Anyway, I am doing the right thing. <laughs> but something tells me um, I will have to restart a loop and come back to find what I need to find. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, I don't remember a thing of that. Let's just investigate over here, I suppose. Make sure I didn't miss anything big. Cause I, I do remember walking around here, I believe. Oh, hello. Um, how do I get inside? Ah, there's another door. Nice. Or not. Uh, frick, what the heck? <laughs> oh, I cannot get over there. Wait, what? Well, sand is coming in from somewhere. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to come back if I don't you know, die first. There is 100% the scroll there. Okay, well, there'll be no do. I'm gonna forget in a day, but whatever. Um, where is this other? Can I make this? I can make this. Whoops. Oh, is this how you get in? Ah, frick. Well done, though. Well done. Nicely balanced. Um, not much oxygen remaining. That's scary. There are trees here, though. Oh my god, wait. I didn't get to any of these four things over here. I didn't get to any of this. I totally forgot. Should we build a sun station to power Ash Twin? I almost can't comprehend this as being suggested seriously. The purpose of the sun station goes against every standard we hold ourselves to in every species. Okay, so they destroyed themselves. A potential annihilation of an entire star system. We should not build the sun station. So this is why the sun is supernovaing? I'm deeply honored. I comprehend you, however, we aren't all but certain the sun station will not cause destruction of stations.
every intelligent species thinks that. Um, right, we I have not seen any of this right here. Anglerfish Overlook District, Stepping Stone District, High Energy Lab Trailhead, Eye Shrine. I am going to need to come back here, obviously, but... Does this not activate the... Oh. Uh, that must be below. Oh! And then there's a... Yeah, okay. This one's Anglerfish Overlook? Yeah, let's do that. Simply because the sand is rising too quickly for me to do anything else. <laughs> Wait. This is where I came from. Never mind. Um. <laughs> job, Mark. God, there's so much here. Good lord. No, nope, already went there. Okay, so I guess. I can try and go here? What is this again? Gravity cannon. Oh, I've already been there. I want the freaking trailhead. Alright, I'm gonna be coming back here, it looks like. Oh, or not. Never mind. <laughs> Frank. Um. Oh, qu'est-ce que c'est? Yup. All right, well, uh, God, there's so much here. Oh my God. I'm trying to see if I can get as much as possible out of this. Oh, there's another one back here that I can't get to. Frick, dude. Can I go? Oh, nothing up here. Nice. Okay, well, hmm. we are going to come back here, <laughs> and for the sake of it, I will cut until I get back to the Sunless City. All right, I'm back. So I'm pretty much here, um, now that I actually remember how to get in. So I also figured that there would be, I don't know, this long form content is different because whatever. I can sit here and not have to worry about editing, more or less, and so I shouldn't really worry about whatever. Um, but it's also occurred to me that, you know, I should keep up... There was a certain commentary I liked to have, uh, and that was more or less... I don't know, talking about the game mechanics or whatever. Um, now, I think I did that really well in like parts one and two, and then I just started talking about what I was doing in the game, which... No inherent problem there, right? But I want to make the commentary mean something, I suppose. But yeah. Um, I think it is fascinating how... I mean, this is just coming to me because I'm exploring, you know, the on the city, and most specifically the fact that <laughs> I haven't explored half of it, if not, like, more than half of it. It's fascinating that, like, the game kind of... You have to iterate your exploration... Which is a weird thing to say, but you have to. Uh, can I? What is this way? Nothing. Okay. And. Uh, let me. Freaking. Yeah. You like when I first started, right? This is one of the first places I came to. And yet. I'm back here and I think it's, you know, I need to do, I, I've come here like four times now um, because there are so many things that I need to look out for. Now, yoink. Um, it's, it's fascinating because nothing here has any meaning the first time. You know, uh, whatever, trailhead or like anglerfish overlook. Like at the on first glance, it's kind of like that doesn't mean anything to me. Uh, and it doesn't. But then, when you come back, actually, I shouldn't use the anglerfish. Uh, the trailhead one that was like the high energy lab trailhead or whatever. Um, 
Like that does doesn't mean anything if you've never s seen the high energy uh, high energy lab anywhere else. Okay, this is like the fastest I can get here, pretty much. Oh my god! I did not mean to fall down. Wow, there is so much down here. Holy crap. Oh my god. Okay, bottom up, boys. As in, we'll search bottom up. What is this? Oh, we found it. <laughs> uh, wait, hold on. What's in here? Nothing? Huh. Okay, well, I mean, this is at the bottom. So I guess we'll start here. This is so sick. I, I'm gonna just assume that you have to follow this. It's a very fair assumption. Or at least conclusion to make. It's gonna hit a cactus at some point, isn't it? Yeah, more or less. Okay, um... This is so fat. Like, if you come in here just too late, you won't make it. Uh, frick. Um, literally trapped. Okay, never mind. We're good. That genuinely stressed me out for a second. No, what the hell? Speaking of getting in here too late, do I have to wait for this? Dude, what? Um, this is uncool. This is this is so much pressure. Let me get get a look ahead, I guess. No, nope, okay, that didn't work. Well, this helps, sort of. I I mean, the sand prevents you from flying through, literally. You can't get above it. All right. Well, race against time now. Oh. Oh, I, I got elevated. That was stressful. That was genuinely stressful. Uh, what? You don't tell me this is a dead end, dude. You're kidding me. Wait, what? No, I think the sand just filled up too quickly. It has to have. What? Okay, new order of business, I guess. How the frick do you get to this lab? This is probably gonna be another like 90 minute episode. Wait, what? Actual heck. Hickers. Can I? No, I definitely can't take the ship down there. <laughs> I. Okay, maybe I have to activate the thingy. The like. The trailhead or whatever it was. Um, I can never find. Okay, the the beacon is far more helpful than I realized. Okay, as it goes away. <laughs> I'm wasting what is apparently very precious time. Just in terms of how freaking long it took me to like. Okay, go, 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 go. Don't care about the ship. Sorry, ship. 
Be quick, but don't rush, Mark. You have said this so many times, and yet you keep rushing. Alright, love it. Let's get up. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. I feel like a speedrunner trying to get these clips. Or the, not the clips, but... I'm trying to, like, cut as many corners as I possibly can. Oh, okay. Maybe there's like a way to get in here faster when you can like access the, the high energy lab properly. Maybe I just went the wrong way in general? I mean last time I took my sweet time, I know that. I feel like I was faster. Okay, maybe this is my fastest. I don't know. I could have saved us all 30 seconds. <laughs> if not a whole ass minute. Posture's trash, I understand. Quick posture check for the boys. And oh, the frames were not pleasant that time around. Okay, the suit this I think I did leave my suit like punctured at some point. Which let the oxygen loose, I suppose, is the why that happens. I don't know what is with the random frame drops, but let's go ahead and refill my oxygen. Love it. Alrighty. Anglerfish Overlook District, Stepping Stone District, High Energy Lab, Eye Shrine District. Okay. Oh. Is that what that does? It gets you back up? Because that wasn't there the first time. 400 points. Okay, let's try not to F this up this time. It doesn't look like there's any other routes, though. This is going to lead me right back to the, yeah. This design of the, the energy pipe thing reminds me of, like, Tekken mods. Nope. Okay, this was my point of struggle. How do I get past here? Like, am I missing something obvious? I mean, if the scout can't get past, like... How is there? I am very perplexed. I can't. I can't. I need to wait. This sucks. <laughs> I hate this. Okay, so the puncture doesn't just affect suit puncture. Okay, vitals critical. Sure, I see that. Okay, Mark, breathe. Look around you. Observe. Observe. There's nothing freaking here. There's nothing here. What? Okay, well, there it is. It's not very helpful, though. Oh my god, I can just go around? Oh my god, I'm a dumbass. Okay. Well, I guess it's a good thing I activated this. <laughs> if you can't go over, go around. Um, okay, I'm just going to keep following the pipe then, which I can't do. 
<laughs> Dude, what the heck? Okay. I mean, this is literally all I can do. I feel so pressured by the sand. So stressful. Um, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, patience, patience, patience. All right. This looks good. This looks like it goes up. Yeah. Oh yeah. Let's go. Let's go. All right. This looks new. Don't tell me I needed to grab something and bring it here. Ah, frick. Okay. Well, this is the high energy lab. It must be. Records show Nomai arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow very slightly before departing from the White Hole Station. Raymond are devising experiments that is a real phenomenon. Right, we've discovered this. In theory, we wanted to reproduce a negative amount of time elapsing between something entering the black hole and exiting. Our experiment setup will first pair a small black hole with a small white hole core to make the setup on the way. Okay. It is possible for an object to exit a white hole before entering the corresponding black hole. Gotcha. Um, ooh. That stresses me out because it sounds like the sand is near, but it's not. But I am on a time crunch. Our experiment here reproduced the anomaly in arrival and departure times. The pie is unconvinced it's more than equipment error. Uh, I hope to strengthen the effect to render it visible to the unaided eyes. We've decided to try adding more energy. I imagine the Sunless City's energy supply should prove efficient. Yara yeah, requests that we let him know before we rewrite into that experiment. All available energy has been rerouted from the city to our experiment. Huh. I'm about to run a new test. Hypothesis confirmed. I saw it. I saw it. Hypothesis confirmed. Cool. So time is nothing. I already knew that. We already knew that. This is this is on not new information. <laughs> I'm just being a, 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 a butt. Oh, there's more. Southern Observatory is asking if creating a 22 minute interval is possible. Oh, that's a long ass time. Increase by adding more energy to the warp core. Problematic with energy, right? Creating a tiny is possible. We are currently unable to generate the necessary energy. Right. We would also likely need an enormous space to fit these proposed new energy warp technologies. The only location large enough would be Ash Twin. My pun was unintended, so I believe it's. And so this is the thing I assume that is causing the supernova like they're trying to take so much energy that these are the planets I would imagine the Ashton project will be one of our biggest undertakings but to build it we need a way to travel quickly between Ashton and each location that holds crucial project materials this will help me because I'm on a time crunch constantly what if we use warp towers, like the one to have on the white hole station, to connect Ash Twin directly to each critical location? We can work in the black hole forge. Each tower in Ash Twin will warp to a different planet. Hello! My gratitude to those who know my imprecise language. Yes, the sun is not a planet. I believe this has been sufficiently covered. <laughs> we can design each tower to visually reflect its warp destination. The giant's deep tower, for instance, could resemble a cyclone. We could model the timber height out to Geyser Mountain. I see. So all those towers on Ash Twin are warps. Which means that at some point, <laughs> I am going to have to go back and forth between each one and do something on each planet. Or so I assume. I'm tempted to go back real quick to make sure I haven't... Oh, why hello. Uh, how do I open it though? If you're here to help, be sure to use the Sunless City. Okay, gotcha. Okay, I, well, I guess I already knew how to get here from the Sunless City, but. Let's, did I miss anything down here? I mean, I might as well just stick around here, but I don't think I missed anything. Um, remove warp core. Insert. Holy crap. Do I actually? No shot. Hold on, what is this? I missed this. What 
What can I do with this? If I put this down here. Okay, and I put this down here. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to teleport, and I was like, this is about to be some portal level stuff. Wait. What is the implication here? I mean, theoretically, I could bring one of these with me. Right? Oh, I didn't see this. What does that do? How do they calculate that? What the hell? I mean, I guess it's possible. I wanted to do a similar mechanic for my game. Um, okay. The, there are many implications, I guess, with these. One of them being... I mean, can I see the anglerfish now? I don't think so. Uh, let's go ahead and leave, I suppose. So I guess now I know that Ash Twin can teleport. Do we want to... No. Because to use these, right, you would need to not only put the, the warp thing on the planet you're going... You're, you're on, but on the planet you're also going to, which would defeat the purpose, because you don't... There's no shot that I would have enough time to do that. Um... Oh, once again. No. Oh, the projection. This is literally the. Oh my god. This is so confusing. <laughs> so the projection plates show you from the perspective of the other planet where there's the projection plate. <sighs> what? I'm, I'm learning so much information. But I'm still so confused. I guess I should could... Actually, you know, let's go back to the ship and see what the ship log says. That should be revealing, at least to some degree. Because if it says there's more to explore in the sun in the city, then I'm going to go back again. Not right now, but that's where I'll start the next time I sit down to play. Okay, so... High Energy Lab, we found it now. Ash Twin Project, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ash Twin Design Towers, yeah, yeah. Okay, there is still more to, to discover, which I'm not surprised because I didn't I definitely didn't hit everything. So I do want to go back there, but in the remaining time of this time loop, um, I would like to go to the Ash Twin. Because Oh, I just saw the quantum moon. Um Because all of these towers will reveal themselves. Yes. And they all are resemblant. Yes. That, okay, this checks out. This checks out. So, how do I teleport using them? That is my question. Um, 
Oh, they each have a warp thing in them. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. And then do I have to use what I learned on the Whitehall station to... I guess... What if... What? Go, let go of me. Ah, uh, ah, uh, frick. No, shoot. No, stop! Eh. Oh, fudge me, dude. All right, well, uh, my ship is gone. Land, please, thank you. I mean, it's not gone, but there's no way I'm getting that back right now. Uh, I don't need to anyway. Well, I don't, I don't want to. Okay, so these are black holes, and therefore I need to sit here and wait until Ash Twin lines up with whatever this tower is, and I don't know which tower it is. This is a text thing. Oh, I can put one in here, but I don't have one. Also, something I'm gathering is that... <clears throat> Wait, what the hell? Which... I don't get which tower is which. Um... Oh, this might be the giant deep, actually. Or giant steep. Well, it's not Brittle Hollow. <laughs> it's not Dark Bramble. <laughs> is it Giant's Deep? I think it is. I'm fairly certain. It is not. Um, maybe it's the Ash Twin, seeing as it's got two towers, you know? All right, let's eat on over here, then. This is Dark Bramble. Right? Oh, I can't get in. Nice. I don't know why this is the only one I can really recognize, but oh boy. Okay, well, I'm inside. Um, oh, hello. I have not found you before. Is the sand going to get me in here? I sure hope not. I mean, it does go through walls. <laughs> okay, cool, it doesn't. Time has passed since I ch uh, checked in with you, Pi. Progressing with Sun Station. My assessment is that our plan will either fail explosively or succeed explosively. You don't. You know I don't find that funny. Rumi thinks I'm a gas. I don't recall requesting your modern situation idea. Uh, uh, I don't see what state of the matter you were. How to do that? I never recall before I said that. Okay, I was going to wait for the station to be beneficial to you both. I'm not saying there's your hypothesis here. That at least we can agree on. Okay. Great. That really didn't yield much helpful information, I don't think. Can I maneuver around that? If I was really good, but I'm not. Um, hey, what do you know? Okay, that was honestly kind of sick. Kind of proud of myself for that one. <laughs> Yoi. Um, oh my god, no shot can this scout open the door, right? I can't open it from the inside if I look at it, right? Hmm. I guess if I, I mean, there's nothing in there. Uh, there is that in there. Well, what, this is Dark Bramble. I have not explored Dark Bramble very much. All right, let's check out the next one, I guess. This is the giant's deep. Huh, this is definitely the cyclone here. Alright, let's land here, and then we'll come on over here. Any writings? No. Um, Timber Hearth. Where are we in terms of... Why is it surrounded in a thingy? In a veil. Oh, maybe that's just showing like that's its usual full size, I guess. Really don't know. Uh, Giant Steep. Almost there. Fertile Hollow. I love how I'm just getting to know all these. Um, or not. Wait, what? That's the sun. Nice. Where is. Oh, I didn't missed it. No. Okay, I'll get there eventually. I will do a full revolution around the sun. <laughs> but 
before the deep meets up with me. The deep. Giant's deep. And this is all I can really do right now. There's Dark Ramble. Uh, and I say that because... Oh. I was correct. Let's freaking go. I am a genius. Ah, frick. No, 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 no. Stop. No, go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. I didn't mean to... I forgot that the planets also rotate. I'm sorry. <sighs> it doesn't matter if the sun is between us. <laughs> this is really cool, though. Okay, so... Oh, this teaches you so much information. Maybe. So, okay. What it does teach you... So there's two things. I'm going to write this down, actually. So you can do... Access Ash Twin... From... Dark Ramble. Um, what else does it teach you? It's got to teach you other stuff at some point. It does teach you other stuff. What, is, what does this teach me? Uh, wait, what was the other thing I needed to do? Oh yeah, I need to revisit Sun the City. Revisit Sun the City. Okay, Supernova is soon anyway. That's fine. Perfect ending. Okay, so we can get back and forth very quickly and efficiently. Step on. Nice. Departure. To that dude, that is. So, departure. I see. At 08, and I arrive at you know, 0.004 seconds prior to. Oh, this is so sick. Okay, I am learning so much information. Let me. Go find Gabbro. Uh, I don't know if he's actually on this planet. No, he's... Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say by. I meant to say island. I don't know how I get those confused, but I do. <laughs> okay. This is very epic. There's still more to explain this on the city. Uh, obviously. And there's so much more to explore here, but I don't know how to get here. Fascinating. Oh, this is the projection stone for the deep. Aha, uh -huh, here we go. Well, I would like to thank... Oh, that is fascinating. I haven't noticed that the first time. Some other star explodes at the same time. Or that's the first time I'm noticing that, I should say. Um... That's just cool. Okay. Oh, I've learned so Oh, I've learned so much. <laughs> All right, I do have to go do work though. As unfortunate as it is, thank you so much for watching. Again, if you did make it all the way through, love to hear it in the comments down below. Um, I will work on my commentary constantly for this long form stuff, especially. But yeah, without further ado, thanks yet again for watching. Have a good one. And as always, don't forget to stay awesome. See you in the next part.